All right, the reason why we bore cut here more on the East Coast than the West Coast guys does is because these hardwoods you're cutting, uh, the fiber is a whole lot stronger in the tree. And when you're cutting them, even though this tree is pretty straight, plumb up and down the lean of it or whatever, it's got a lot of head weight. And those limbs are heavy. Whereas like the firs and the cedars and everything have a, you know, they're, they're pretty symmetrical and pretty straight up and down most of the time. Well, here, if you don't bore cut, a lot of the times, no matter how fast or how strong your saw is, the tree will start falling a whole lot faster than your saw will go. And if you're not careful, you end up possibly getting barber chair if it's a really heavy leaner or it falls and you have a really, really thick hinge and you end up pulling a lot of fiber. And when you pull fiber, you could pull strands of fiber, you know, a foot, foot and a half long. And that takes money off of your log. So that's the reason why we tend to bore cut a lot more. And I don't always bore cut if the tree's uh, back leaning away from the way I want it to go. And then I will back cut it normal and then sink my wedges or whatever, you know. But you can't just, you know, you can cut them like you can cut them normal back cut first but you like you love to have a four inch hinge or a two inch hinge or you know it love the barber chair just depends but it depends on how straight the tree is and how much limb weight it's got going towards where you're going you know if you got a pretty straight up and down tree and it don't have a lot of limb weight one way or the other then you can do it the conventional way but uh, if it's got a lot of lean or even a lot of limb weight, head weight, whatever you want to call it, uh, going to where you want to go, then that tree will fall way faster than uh, you can cut it, no matter if your saw is ported or whatever. So that's that's t tends to be why we bore cut a whole lot more uh, out here. More run the 500i, got a 28 inch uh, steel RS chain on it, and a uh, 28 steel light bar on it, and. Uh, We'll see how this baby does. We're gonna put, I'm putting the 400C and the 500I to work today.
Mm-hmm.